Education not deportation. Education not deportation. Education not deportation. Uh, hoy estamos aquí por, por Isaac y Jonathan porque queremos informar a la comunidad por qué ellos han tomaron la decisión de ir con otros estudiantes de, de alrededor del país a ir a Alabama y hacer una acción a, en contra de inmigración para exponer a las leyes racistas y las mentiras del gobierno de este país. Ellos mismos fueron directamente a, a, a las policías de, de ICE y se enfrentaron y le dijeron ¿Por qué están pasando leyes como H-56 y por qué están deportando a nuestras familias y separándolos? ¿Ustedes van a deportarme a mí, que yo soy un documentado? A ese momento que él, Jonathan, dijo que era un documentado, la ley de, de los de ICE de HB-56 se puso en efecto. Fue, de, fue detenido y después ICE de, uh, bas, Barrera, cuando fue a, a buscar a su amigo, que era Jonathan, lo, también lo, de, lo, lo detenieron. Inmediatamente fueron puestos en procedimientos de deportación, inmediatamente fueron llevados de Alabama hacia Luisiana y están en proceso de deportación. The reason why Jonathan and Isaac they're in a detention facility right now is because there was no press there, there was no rally to to really talk, to really put attention to what ICE is doing. So our action that we took that we took forward um, past week was a two action. It was a public one and a silent one. We took part in the and the public one. I was one of the ones arrested inside the state capitol, and she's going to talk about her experience right now. But she was one of the 11 that was arrested on the streets. The reason why we decided to do this public action is to show that whenever the cameras are rolling, whenever there's people in rallies, ICE doesn't do anything to us. They continue saying that the President Obama, they're, they're, they don't deport um, dream eligible students. However. They didn't know that we had a silent action that these two young men were taking part of. And that's what really shows that when the cameras are not rolling, they're lying to us. They're saying that they are not deporting undocumented youth. And the reality is that they are. Education not deportation. Education not deportation. In two weeks, I am set to be deported. Say bye bye to this country. Say bye to the country I've been calling my home. I've attended CSU Chico. I graduated with a 3.5 GPA in pre law. At the moment, attending CSULA to get a master's in business. Después que hemos escuchado tanto a la administración de Obama y él mismo en sus palabras diciendo que no iba a deportar estudiantes que eran elegibles para el DreamHack. Esto va a mostrar que sí están deportando estudiantes que son elegibles para el DreamHack. Que los números son números para ellos simplemente. Que no importa que están, no les importa que están criminalizando nuestras comunidades. Que están separando nuestras familias. This is why one of the main reasons that Jonathan and Isaac are in a detention facility. Um, and that's what we're asking President Obama and ICE now to come forward and say why is it that they didn't arrest any of the 13 undocumented immigrants that got arrested on the streets when the camera and the rally, but they were able to arrest two um, other individuals that were part of the same action um, just because there was no rally and no, and no, and no cameras rolling. I hope that this that this action will eventually uh, 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 tell a story to, and, and uh, force the Obama administration to recognize that many of those young people are as American as anybody else around here and it's time to recognize their presence as legitimate Americans and not as some criminals. Uh, they are students, they're part of our community, they are uh, neighbors, they are lovers, we're dating them, we, we want them back and we want them back soon.